hello guys welcome to this video in this video question is on what sum of money will be the difference between the compound interest and simple interest for two years be equal to rupees 25 if the rate of interest charge for both is 5 percent per annum so this is the question so solve this so first we find out the value of the simple interest so si is equal to the formula is principal into rate into time by 100 so you put down the value the principal is unknown so that principal is p Rate of interest is given 5% and time is given 2 years by 100. So you cut 250, 5, 10. So it becomes 5 by 10. So therefore, this will be of a simple interest. So now I find out the formula for the compound interest. So CI is equal to, we know, principal into 1 plus rate by 100 to the power n minus again the principal so now i put down the values principal unknown p into 1 plus rate is 5 by 100 to the power n is to the power d time that is 2 minus so this p if we take as the common so this p will become minus 1 here minus 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 1 so now i write p into 500 i cut 1 by 20 so 1 by 20 it means we take 20 as the LCM, 20 into 120 plus 1 to the power 2 minus 1. So again principal into, so 20 plus 1, 21 by 20. So this one square minus 1. So this square ma minus 1 we do here only. So minus 1, it, we will do like this. So take 20 as the LCM, so 20 square minus 21 square minus again 20 into minus 1 that is 20 square so now to take out the value we have to you know, find out the square first because there will be a great difference if we will just write 1 square so principal into 21 square that is 21 into 21 1 2 so 2 is a 4 441 so this is a value for 21 square so that 441 minus 20 square we all know that is 400 minus again the 400 so it becomes principal into 41 by 400 so this will be the value for our compound interest so now in the question it is given that ci minus si or the difference it is given rupees 25 so therefore between if we write these two formula that is ci is p into 41 by 100 sorry 400 minus the si that is 51 5 by 10 is equal to will be the 25 so here also we take this p as the common so this p will become minus 1 so p into 41 by 400 minus 1 by 10 is equal to 25 so now p into we take out this value 400 take as lcm 41 minus 40 10 into 400 that is 40 now 25 again so now principal into now 1 by 400 remains is equal to 25 so now finally we take this 400 to this side so it goes for multiplication as it is here in division so it become p equals to 21 into 400 which will be equal to rupees 10,000 so therefore our principal is rupees 10,000 this is our final answer for this question so guys, thanks for watching this question and please subscribe to my channel for more solutions.